now we are going to discuss about how we can change ma uh, uh, multiple uh, document value in FPL 5n for particular customer outstanding values okay so we go to FBL 5n okay so here is FBL 5n and what we are going to do is we are going to select this and we'll execute and these are all the outstanding stuff that is there and here suppose I will want to see or uh, I will try to make all the payment terms to uh, something let's see first we go to edit select all okay and first we see whether payment terms is available okay payment terms is not available we can have payment method let's see let's bring in some payment method here so what we go here we select this and we go to meth method and here we just bring it here we copy it and here we can see all this payment method now we select all and let's bring in some other text field also oh there is a text field so let's see whether we can mass change so now we select this we go to payment method and we select suppose e and the text field we put test and let's see whether it updates or not we click on execute changes okay so if you see changes have been made it doesn't show up yet here but you have to go click list list and refresh and voila you see all these things have changed now you might say that that payment method field has gone so we we'll just do a search again meth and we'll bring it in and here if you see it is e down so let's just make sure this happens so what we are going to do we click on this layout and we put test z test for mine and save as oh i need to put user specific some other language this is okay now here what we are going to do again we are going to go edit select all and we'll select this and we'll put the text as s for hana because this is for hana system and what payment method we want we will put app i will put t let's see it works or not we'll click execute well checks changes have been made we select list we click on refresh and voila it has changed so this is the way to change mass uh, uh, updates to a particular field or particular fields that is available in the mass change and this is very useful for the accounts receivable department in month end and this is like a bread and butter for them so this is the way you can do mass changes in FPL 5n that's it for this tutorial stay tuned to my uh the, the channel and happy sap learning